Hello, and welcome to part 18 of my Skyrim VR role-playing Let's Play. In our last episode, Raven's friend Inigo was experiencing psychic attacks in the form of strange visions and what he described as his mind vibrating and feeling like someone was trying to pull it out through his ear. Ouch! They followed clues in his visions to a strange man named Langley. Inigo's experiences were caused by Langley attempting a summoning spell. Langley says Inigo is destined to fulfill a prophecy and save the world from an evil entity called the Doomstrider. Unfortunately, Langley couldn't provide much more information. For now, all they can do is just wait until Langley has more dream visions. On the bright side, the spell to summon Inigo works great for Raven. No more getting separated. Well, without further ado, let's get right into episode 18. Okay, let's head back to Dawnstar. I don't know about you guys, but I could use some rest. This has been a rather long day. At least it feels like it. Oh, there once was a hero named Raven the Right who couldn't be beaten in any fair fight. Mm, I am sure I can be beaten. The sky is sure beautiful. Now ain't this a surprise. Bruce, right up. How did I miss you on the way past the first time? Must have been hiding. Ah, crap. I can't move. Hey, Lucian. This. Oops. Oh, shit. There's another enemy. You want stuns? And stop. Let's see if I can just dump some of this stuff so I can join the fight. Come on. Got it. I'm just gonna drop a few things. So I can join the fight. I'm coming. Hey, Foos, you! Hey, you were supposed to go off the edge and die. Dude, you forgot to die. Oh, I don't want to summon Inigo. Fire. That's it. That's all you've got. Burn! Dun, dun, dun. Another one bites dust. Fuck it. Shh. Okay. Silver and gold. You guys ready to get out of here? I believe we were headed for Dawnstar. Wait, where is... Inigo and Lucian? Ah, crap. I think I lost them. Oh, I see someone coming. Inigo! Have you seen Lucian? Was he back there? Is he coming? Is that him? I think that's him. Sorry I lost you guys. Wasn't trying to ditch you. Does something feel wrong in the air here to you? I hadn't noticed anything, but from what I heard earlier, they might be having problems with a dream demon. I know a little bit about that, so I'm going to see if I can help them out. 
But first, I really need to get some sleep. Hurry up, Inigo! What is he up to back there? Huh? Inigo? Maybe he had to make a pit stop. Sorry. Welcome. What Let me know if you want. That for? Think I got a clean mug around Need here something. Oh man, I thought I still had the bed. Hi. Need a room? Yeah. Don't worry. Nightmares don't seem to happen for travelers. Good. Sure thing. It's yours for a day. Thanks. What do you have for sale? Drink for the thirsty, food for the hungry. Thank you. See ya. And what might you need? Mm. A bed. And some sleep. Let me know if there's anything else what you need. What is with these perverts watching me sleep? Jeez. Socks. So you're reforming a dawn guard. Vampire artists or something. I'm gonna see about selling some of this stuff. I'm not against the idea, but why? I'm just worried about raising a child in the middle of this war of yours. Oh, but mine. It's not my war. We're people's wars. What kind of life will you be giving a little one if you stay here? Well, let me think about it. Okay. I work steel. Hi. Weapon home. Seems like no one is getting a decent night's rest in Dawnstar, stranger. Best buy your steel and move on. Yeah, I might be able to help out with that. What do you have for sale? Hmm. Blades, helmets, pretty much anything to suit your needs. Okay. Thanks. Come back if you need to. Hey, Lucian. Everything all right? I can sell that crap I gave you. Oh, please. Give me all the good stuff. That way you don't have to carry it. Thanks. Bye, Raven. Hey, in it go. If you do not mind, when we have a moment, I would like to discuss something with you. Remind me next time we are seated somewhere safe. Langley's house would be a bad idea, though. What I want to discuss concerns him. All right, the next time we're someplace safe, we can have a chat. Good. It is not a pressing issue, just something I would like to hear your opinion on. All right. Hey, I can sell any crap I gave you to carry. What is yours is mine. Thank you. Let us go. Hi. Need a dagger? No? How about a claymore? Let's see what you got. Hmm. Blades, helmets, pretty much anything you suit your needs. Actually, I've just got some more stuff to sell. Hey, thanks. Do you work for the ships? Aye. I've worked on a few moorings here and there for it. Most of the ship captains are superstitious about who works on their vessels, though. And Dawnstar is known for its bad luck. We're the last port of call before Windhelm, and the war we trade makes rich targets for pirates. Yeah, I would imagine. Huh. Take care. Farewell. Hi! I helped my husband Rustler run the forge. He's a marvel with steel. Is there anything you could tell me about Dawnstar? Not much. I came here a few years ago from Hammerfell when I married. The land is beautiful, but I can't stand this cold. I don't know how Rustleaf manages it. So you came here all of the way from Hammerfell? Wow. That's right. Home of the Red Guards. The land of sand and seas. I hope one day I'll convince Rustleaf to take us back there. Until then, I'm content running the forge together here in Dawnstar. Okay, well, take care and try to stay warm. It's cold. Mm-hmm. I wouldn't feel weapon You guys don't see a general store around here, do you? Yikes! Jeez. 
storms around here are really something. Okay, I want to go back to the inn and talk to that guy. That priest of Mara. He seemed to know something about the nightmares. But first... Inigo! Speak to me. Can you carry some of my crap, please? What are we trading? I'm gonna give you some stuff that I want to keep, but not carry. Uh. Thank you. And I've got more. I'm just gonna drop it on the ground. Then. Hey, Inigo! Mm -hmm. I know you can carry more. What would you have me do? Pick this How up. Can I help you, my friend? Yeah. Whatever you Pick say. that up and that and that it will be and that. That. Oh, you missed one. Good idea. Thank you. Let's go inside. They say the the whole of the vigilant. Burned it to the ground. I would be careful. Just open the fire. Take a seat and get the cold down. And what might you need? Hi there. Yes, sir. What is going on in Dawnstar? The entire town is being plagued by horrible nightmares. They're in serious danger, but I'm afraid there's little I can do about it. How can they actually be in danger? I mean, these are just dreams, right? These dreams are manifestations created by the Daedric Lord, Vermina. She has an awful hunger for our memories. In return, she leaves behind nightmares. Not unlike a cough marks a serious illness. I must end her terrible influence over these people before the damage becomes permanent. So what's your plan? I need to return to the source of the problem. To Nightcaller Temple. Perhaps you'd be willing to assist me in that regard. You need to return. Does this mean you've been there before? I've already said too much. If anyone overhears what we're saying, it could start a panic. I would simply ask that you trust me and help me end Dawnstar's nightmares. All right, I'll trust you for now. Just let me know how I can help. Wonderful. My Lady Mara will be quite pleased. Nightcaller Temple is only a short walk from Dawnstar. Come, we must hurry. All right, then let's go. I promise to answer all of your questions. Follow me. Okay. Uh, Lucian? Mm. In I go. Delicious sweet roll down the hatch. I think you guys are blocking his way. Looks like enough room. Maybe if you come over here. Okay, there we go. He's moving. What's that? Oh, it's just a wolf. They can handle it. Let's get moving. Lucian, I think you're in his way again. Yep, nope, he's still not moving. How can I follow you if you won't go anywhere? There we go. Now he's sort of moving. The tower on that hill is our destination. Go around here. I'm not familiar with the tower's history, but it was deserted for quite a long time before Nightcrawler Temple was established inside. When the temple was active, the priests would rarely be seen in Dawnstar. They preferred to live a solitary existence. The temple had been abandoned for decades now. Ironically, but we were looking at it. There's a small shrine tomorrow I established inside the tower's entrance hall. I was hoping to see spiritual guidance. Perhaps my prayers were answered. 
recently stumbled across dark spot is more than a mere coincidence. Actually, I was just here to help a friend. I need a bite to eat. Much better. Okay, could you go any slower? Starting to slosh. I agree. Can we move a little quicker? Hey, Erinder, when I asked if you could go any slower, that was not a challenge. I thought you said we were in a hurry. This is not how you hurry. Is that the tower up there? I think I see the tower from here. You know something? Forget this. I'm gonna go ahead. If you ever arrive, we can go in and take care of the problems Dawnstar is having. Hey, wolves. Better make sure they don't attack. Spiders. See how you like fire. Ow. Got him. Now, let's see if Erinder ever bothers showing up. What's this? Looks like you figured out how to move. Why couldn't you have moved like that when I was staying with you? Oh yeah. He's gone. Alright. Years ago, this temple was raided by an orc war party seeking revenge. They were being plagued by nightmares, just like the people of Dawnstar. Continue. Before we enter, I must warn you about the dangers that could be lurking within. I heard you. Years ago, this temple was raided by an orc war party seeking revenge. They were being plagued by nightmares, just like the people of Dawnstar. Were they successful? No. Knowing they could never defeat the orcs, the priests of Vermina released what they called the Miasma, putting everyone to sleep. If everyone is asleep, why is it dangerous? I'm concerned that when this place is unsealed, the Miasma will dissipate and they'll awaken, both orcs and priests alike. What does the Miasma do exactly? The miasma was created by the priests of Vermina for their rituals. It's a gas that places the affected in a deep sleep. Because the rituals would last for months or even years, the miasma was designed to slow down the aging process. Is this gas dangerous? Sadly, yes. The longer an individual is exposed to the miasma, the more the mind can become damaged. Those who've been under the effect of it for extended periods of time 
have been known to lose their minds entirely. In some cases, a few never awoke at all. All right, sounds fun. Let's get inside. Good news is, I'm already lost my mind, so... Yes, my daughter. I'm not your daughter. What is it I can help with? I'm here to help you. Hey, where's Inigo and Lucian? Yes, my daughter. What are you what playing is it I can at? Help with? Did you keep Inigo and Lucian from following us? You better not try any dirty tricks. Give me just a moment. I'm just gonna rob the place. There. It's over. Oh, you're gonna burn stone? Oh, well, that was interesting. Down there? Behold the skull of corruption, the source of Dawnstar's woes. We must reach the inner sanctum and destroy it. Come, there's no time to lose. Hmm. Well, I don't like the fact that Inigo and Lucian didn't follow me. I can't do anything about Lucian. But Inigo. Yeah, why didn't you guys come in? Did something stop you? I find it suspicious. Damn it! The priest must have activated this barrier when the miasma was released. It looks difficult to breach. Impossible, actually. I got the dead bodies through. I wonder. There may be a way to bypass the barrier, but I must check their library and confirm it can be done. You seem to know an awful lot about this place. I suppose there's no point in concealing the truth any longer. My knowledge of this temple comes from personal experience. I was a priest of Vermina. You really should have just told me the truth in the first place. Yes, you're right. I should have. But I didn't know what to say. When the orcs raided the temple, I fled. I left my brothers and sisters behind to die. I've spent the last few decades living in regret and seeking redemption for Mara. And by her benevolence, I will right my wrongs. Okay, well, let's go. I still have my key to the library. Whenever you're ready, let's move on. I'm ready. We mustn't tarry. The skull needs to be destroyed as soon as possible. You s really seem to think this is moving fast, huh? I've seen frozen mud crabs go faster. Wow. It's just up here. Be careful. We're certain to find more of the awakened within. I'm ready. How you guys like fire? Is that the what is this? Hey, look at this thing. This thing is absolutely 
hideous. Hey, Inigo, take a look at this. This thing is hideous. I love it. Not much left of this library, is there? This library used to be filled with arcane volumes. Now look at it. Almost everything has been burned. I hope the tome we need is still intact. Yeah. Me too. Perhaps we can locate the information I need. All right, what am I looking for? We're looking for a book of alchemical recipes called the Dream Stride. The tome bears the likeness of Vermina on the cover. It should be here somewhere. All right. If you'll check the shelves around the balcony, I'll check around the lower level. You got it. I'm gonna grab this, though. Up here, huh? How about over here? Hey, I found it! Oops. <laughs> Got an ugly cover. Okay. Now if I can just find Erender. Help myself to a few of these books. They're not doing anyone any good here. Erinder! Erinder? There you are. Yes, my daughter. What is it I can help with? I found it. Let me take a look. More will be prized. There is a way past the barrier to the inner sanctum. It involves a recipe for a liquid known as Vermina's Torpor. Is that some kind of potion? Yes. The Torpor grants an ability the priests of Vermina called the Dream Stride, using dreams to travel distances in the real world. Well, that sounds pretty amazing. Quite amazing, yes. Alchemy and the blessings of a divine distilled down into a ingestible liquid. Sadly, I have yet to see it function in person. Let me guess. You expect me to test it, right? Uh, as a sworn priest of Mara, the elixir won't work for me. The torpor will only work for priests of Vermina, or the unaffiliated. Of course. Sounds dangerous. Can you be sure it'll work? I will not lie to you. There is some risk involved. The last time the torpor was embarked could have been decades ago. But I swear upon Lady Mara that I will do everything within my power to prevent any harm from befalling you. Do you know where we can find some of this? I believe there is a laboratory in the East Wing. If we proceed there, we should be able to locate a sample. Okay. What does the Dream Stride do? You'll be viewing the memory of another through your own eyes 
and with your own body. Those around you will perceive you as normal, and you will find the words you utter may not be your own. Thanks to all of these odd principles, there is quite a lot of debate as to whether this is really a dream, or just the machinations of Vermina. How do I know when to wake up? I will watch over you as you slumber to ensure your safety. If I deduce anything is amiss, I will use my arts to bring you back. Otherwise, I am uncertain what will end your dream stride. Perhaps when Vermina's curious appetite has been filled. That sounds like never. The laboratory adjoins the library. I'm hoping we'll find a sample of the torpor left undamaged. We've been lucky so far. looking for it should be in a small bottle very similar to a potion I'll begin searching up here then I'll search down here the torpor should be in a tall bottle with dark liquid if you find it bring it to me and I'm also gonna collect all these ingredients which somehow are all still perfectly fresh and usable hungry. A fresh carrot? Why can't I pick this up? Okay. Erinder. Yes, my daughter. What is it I can help with? I found the topor. I'm relieved you discovered a bottle intact. This place looks as though it was ransacked by the orcs. So. I've taken us this far, but you need to guide us the rest of the way. Drink. What? Here? Now? Dawn Star's fate rests in that tiny bottle. The longer we wait, the more damage Vermina could be doing to those poor people. I understand your hesitation, but I promise you that it works. Okay. Let's continue. We still have. 
Let me grab the rest of the loot around here. What's to do? As soon as I gather all this stuff. Okay. Bottoms up. The orcs have breached the inner sanctum, Brother Varen. We must hold. We can't allow the skull to fall into their hands. But no more than a handful of us remain, brother. Then we have no choice. The miasma must be released. The miasma? But, brother... We have no alternative. It's the will of Vermina. And what about you, Brother Casimir? Are you prepared to serve the will of Vermina? I have made my peace. I am ready. Then it's decided. Brother Casimir, you must activate the barrier and release the miasma. Let nothing stop you. Brother Thorin. We must remain here and guard this skull with our lives, if necessary. Agreed. To the death. Then let it be done. Farewell, my brothers. Oh, great. Hopefully I can get through. How do I get through here? Uh. Excuse me? Can I just push past here? Can I just squeeze through? No. Maybe. I just had to risk it. Excuse me. Wow, I made it. There it is. Take a deep breath and a deep sleep. Yeah, I'm back. Removing this should do the trick. Where's Inigo? Hey, where's Inigo? He better be okay. I must be the fastest man alive. Hey, it worked. Mara be praised. You vanished after drinking the torpor and materialized on the other side. I've never seen anything quite like it. Yeah, it was actually quite interesting. It was as if I was really there. How I envy you. I can only imagine the excitement of seeing history through the eyes of another. Sadly, I am resigned to just reading of its wonders through my research of the skull. Yeah, we can talk about it later. Indeed. My reverence for Vermina's machinations should not take precedence over our mission. No. My apologies. The inner sanctum lies ahead. We must reach the skull and put an end to Dawnstar's troubles. Lead on, my friend. All right. Come. We must get to the skull and destroy it. 
Seems like I just came from here. I guess that guy's already dead. Ready our weapon, my friend. There is killing to be done. Time for your final Dead and he's still standing there. That's not weird. Potions, treasure. Gee, it looks like the orcs took everything. Yeah, the orcs took everything. What now? Oops. <laughs> All right. <then. laughs> That's one of them. Never should have come here. Taking this place by storm. I no longer use that name. I'm Miranda, priest of Mara. You're a traitor. You left us to die and then ran before the miasma took you. No, I, I, I was scared. I wasn't ready to sleep. Enough of your lies. I can't allow you to destroy the skull, priest of Mara. Uh, we have to. Then you leave me no choice. They Over mustn't here. stop us. Ah. You knew them, huh? I knew Varen and Thoric. They were my friends. Is this punishment for my past? Is it Mara's will to torment me so? Well, they were trying to kill us, so we didn't have much choice. And had they succeeded, Dawnstar's fate would be sealed. You have a unique way of looking at things, my friend. It's time. The skull must be destroyed. If you'll stand back, I'll perform the ritual granted to me by Lady Mara. First, an incantation to remove the barrier. Let me get a closer look at it. Looks kind of creepy. I call upon you, Lady Mara. The skull hungers. It yearns for memories. Hey, I hunger too. <laughs> 
power to break through this barrier and to send the skull to the depths of oblivion. He's deceiving you. What? When the ritual's complete, the skull will be free, and then Arinder will turn on you. Quickly, kill him now. Kill him and claim the skull for your own. Vermina commands you. Vermina? Foose you, Vermina! Why would I be cooperating with a dream demon? Let's see if I can grab it, though. Nope. Dang. <laughs> Can't steal it for my own. I'm certainly not going to do what Vermina told me to. He's as slow at this as he is at walking. Are you done? Is that it? Well, it's gone. Arinder! Forgive me if I don't appear relieved. This temple has taken its toll on me. So are you going to be okay? In time, I believe I will. I'd construct an Amiga shrine tomorrow in the antechamber where we entered. My intention was to spend the rest of my years here, burying the past and praying for forgiveness. But instead, I wish to offer my services to you. If you ever wish to journey with me, I'll be here. Okay, thanks. There's no need to thank me. What you did was for the people of Dawnstar. If anyone should be thanked, it should be you. No, Vermina tried to get me to kill you. I told her to foose herself. Hmm, now let's get out of here. I hope that Lucian's okay. I mean, I hope he's still outside. Not sure why he couldn't get in. Wait, how do I get out of here? I think it's this way. Oh yeah, this is the way. Inigo? Are you stuck? Eh, if he's stuck, I'll teleport him out. Lucian! You okay? We noticed you missing. Back to Dawn Star. Get that out of the way. Don't need dead dragons blocking the roads. I'm no one special. Just a miner who swings a pickaxe for his drinking money. Okay. Don't sell yourself short. At least you got a job and support yourself. Come on in. We got warm food, warm drinks, and warm beds. Need something? I've seen you around, but I haven't seen your parents. They're dead. Oh. My pa was a sailor. Took me with him on his last trip. After he got sick, they put us off here and left without us. He died a few days later. I've tried to make do since then, but it's been hard. Real hard. It's nice wow, to I'm really home. sorry for your loss. How about if I adopt you? Really? Do you 
Do you have a place I can live? Yeah, I've got a nice house, and there's a school right next door, and there's lots of kids to play with, and anything you can need. Oh, wow. Are you... are you sure? You really wouldn't mind? Of course I'm sure. I would be proud to call you my son. Really? You mean it? Well, thanks, Ma. I promise I won't be any trouble at all. Just... Just let me get my things and say goodbye to everyone. I'll meet you. I'm gonna go to sleep, okay? I'll see you at home. And that will be all for tonight's episode. Thank you for watching, and if you enjoyed it, please click like and subscribe. And I will hopefully see you for the next episode. Until then, may Talos be with you.